Hello, dear friends, my English-speaking audience. Uh, there is someone left, probably, because somebody joked in the comments that I have to learn Russian, probably. Well, I was thinking, because I'm not doing it uh, regular uh, English readings, I want to do random. I'll we'll find out what sign we'll be doing for. Uh, maybe I will not be able to do for all 12 signs, but I want to do a reading for each sign um, Celtic cross for the rest of the summer and we'll pick one card and what sign it will be astrological sign, I mean we'll do the reading for them Five of Cups Mars in Scorpio. For Scorpio people, Scorpio, hello, we'll be doing reading for you in the first place. Well, Celtic Cross, it's, uh, let's say, reading that can tell about anything. For some Scorpio, maybe it will be reading about love. For some Scorpio, about some other stuff, about work, about some family issues, some events maybe, doesn't have to be from now on, now it's uh, 11th of June, it doesn't have to be uh, exactly from 11th of June till the 31st of August, doesn't have to be, it can be about some particular event, something that is important for you, that spirit, the source wants you to know and want to tell you through cards. Well, Scorpio, a reading for you. Now it's June and this reading will be Celtic Rose for the end of, till the end of summer, for whole summer. What this reading will be about? <clears throat> what they want to tell you? It's about creativity, it's about abundance, pleasures, happiness, something that makes you feel joyful, happy, fulfilled emotionally in the first place. In the first place, it's emotional fulfillment. Maybe you have some wishes that you want to come true. Maybe you want to finish some uh, painting. For example, also can be. Or maybe you're writing a book, maybe you're writing a music. Maybe you just want to have a fun, to be happy. Well, what's crossing it? So, uh, we're talking generally about happiness and abundance, about something that makes us feel good, that we wish for. Okay, it can be that is important for Scorpio now, even good mood. <coughs> but outside, it looks like, again, maybe you're waiting for some invitation. For some of you, maybe you're waiting for new love to come in. Maybe you want to fall in love. Maybe you already fall in love and you're waiting when this person will have feelings. <laughs> to you as well. So, cups, all cups, for me it's emotions, for me it's creativity, for me it's soul, happiness, something that makes us happy. Somebody maybe even want to have a kid. Maybe it's for some Scorpio, it's also uh, relative this uh, I want to have a baby I want to get pregnant I want to have love in my life I want some wish to come true and I'm waiting I hope to get I don't know good news and when I'll get the, this news I will know that things will be all right so it's like, you know, it's a, it's a lot of water here, but you are a water sign, so it's quite all right. What are your thoughts 
plans what you have in your head right now Scorpio what Scorpio thinking about <laughs> cups this is a love reading Scorpio this is love reading two of cups it's card of understanding card of love when we love somebody and this person loves us as well so it's not like this unrequired love painful and unhappy you want this happiness you want this understanding maybe you want that someone will trust you somebody really wanna uh, have love in their life maybe with some particular person maybe you already like this person very much you just want uh, waiting for them to respond to you love friendships harmony happiness, trust, being together with somebody. So it's about this. This is what you're thinking about, dear Scorpio. What is uh, the reality now for you? What is real? Because this is like what we're thinking, what we're feeling, how we see it. But here we have the reality. What's going on in your life? Ten of Cups. Hmm. Ten of Cups. It's card, it is card of happiness, harmony, family, people supporting each other there. It's fulfillment, actually. I don't know what you're thinking about. Or I'm not getting something. Well, maybe you have a happy family. Maybe you have everything. Maybe you just want another baby, let's say. Or maybe you're happy with your partner. Everything is all right. Everything is fine. But maybe you want to have a baby because you think it will uh, bring you closer to each other. It will make you even happier than you are right now. Maybe you're expecting a grandchild. Maybe you are happy in your family and you're proud of your family. Everything is just fine. But you, maybe your daughter or wife of your son, daughter-in-law may be pregnant and you're waiting when this baby will appear. It has to happen this summer. And you uh, can't wait to see this baby. So maybe for some of you it's like this because it's two happy heart cards two happy cards Scorpio I don't even know what to think maybe you're happy maybe you have a wonderful family they loves you they adores you they uh, supporting you helping you they giving you everything they can but you want to have the one you want to have relationships because, of course, you love them, everything is fine, but we want to have a partner, love partner. Okay. Past. The root of the situation. What was previously that um, lead you to this situation? Knight of Swords. In all these cups, this Knight of Swords looks quite aggressive. Maybe there was a fight with somebody. Maybe there was a split up. Maybe someone hurt you. Something went wrong or something happened too fast. I don't know, in a good or in a bad way. Actually, this Knight is upright. I think there was some troubles because in all these cups so smooth so gentle so nice to see this uh, warrior for me it's like uh, it's a problem actually it was a problem something happened in the past and I don't think it was a nice uh, uh, or it was really unexpected too fast too fast uh, came to your life 
we'll see. Nearest future. If we're talking about, uh, we're doing reading for the rest of the summer, nearest future, couple of weeks, two, three weeks, maybe. Uh, what will happen for Scorpio in the near future? Nine of Pentacles. I don't know, you will get some uh, profit out of your previous investments, maybe. Uh, you will achieve something. Things will be really good. Maybe you will buy something. Maybe you will prepare something. Mm, you will get uh, some money. You will be appreciated. Things will be really good for you. Um, I don't see problems here. But here we had all these cups, 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 cups. But remember, Nine of Cups, when we're talking about heart of the matter, Nine of Cups, it's not only pleasures. It's not only eating, drinking, having fun and uh, being lazy and everything is so nice. No, it's also abundance. We're talking about abundance, achievements, uh, something that is um, good, something that makes us rich. But here it is, something is happening. Uh, if you will be uh, finishing something recently, here in June or beginning of July, it will be successful. You will be successful in this. But uh, for me, it's not so much about love, friendships, agreements. Ah, maybe if you wanna... Mm, mm -hmm. If you want particular something, if it's not a love reading, if it's not a love reading, maybe you like in your thoughts, maybe you like, let's say, particular company, or university and you wanna go there you wanna get there probably you will get there nine of pentacles it's card of success actually maybe in the recent past something appeared unexpectedly or there was some troubles difficulties problems even conflicts with somebody now you are all right your family supporting you you feel quite secure, but you want something particular in this two of chalices. It's like when we're seeing something, oh, I want exactly this thing. <laughs> so maybe you want something particular and you're waiting for some news. But here you will be successful. Uh, let's see you. I mean, your behavior, your way of action. How you will be, Scorpio, what you will be doing, how you will be acting. What is this blah, 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 blah. It's a Wheel of Fortune. It was inverted. Wheel of Fortune, it's always like life is moving. Things are changing. Uh, they are not stopping. They are moving on all the time. Like seasons changing. Uh, life is going on. Here, in reverse, this, this is like a little bit, we can't, Jupiter, giving us something, uh, pushing us somewhere, bringing people into our life, giving us some possibilities, but sometimes we are like, can't see them or can't take them for some reason. So be careful with this, Scorpio. Also, you might be a little bit like slowing down for some reason. Like you... I don't know why. Instead of go moving on, you will be like taking some pauses. Yeah. Hmm. Very interesting. Mood might uh, change. You might, you might be moody for some reason in this period mm. well let's have a look uh, from uh, outside uh, influences people events uh, situations what will be there who will be there it will be some queen of cups somebody 
I think, I still think it's someone from your family, your mother, girlfriend, a friend. It's genuine reading, so queen can be a man as well, man, woman. Agenda is uh, not, uh, we must not look at this, that it's queen, then it can be a woman. No, it can be person. That will be uh, helping you, supporting you. taking care of you, always wondering how are you there, are you all right? Someone will take care of you and yes, like a mother taking care of the child, someone who is like a nun, Mary Poppins, <laughs> maybe, so with someone like this always there, not so pushy, very kind, very sweet, very nice, very nice woman, loving woman, kind woman, soft woman. So it's someone who is very nice and will be supporting you um, for every, for all Scorpio. I think it's somebody, it's a person who will be trying to go, to help you to go through this situation. Is it good? Is it bad? Is it happy? Or there is some difficulties? Maybe you're worrying a little bit. you like moody. This person trying to help you. Don't worry. Everything will be all right. I'll do it for you. Just go there. I'll be waiting for you. So it's like, like this. Very sweet energy. And honest love in her heart, in heart of this person, honest love and honest support and really this person care about you but as I told you it can be anybody but someone who is really loving well your fear or hope in this situation about this situation or in this period of time uh, I guess it's hope, uh, the magician. Magician, it's ability to do what I want, to get some job position, to uh, get in some uh, school or university or college, because it's about study as well. Um, you hope to have ability to be able to do something, to be able to get something, to be able to control something as well. Like, I want to be independent. I want to do things my way, how I think it's right. So this is your hope. Well, let's see outcome for the end of summer. Scorpio, you have a good reading, actually. Besides that, you are moody. Past, it's, it's, all, it's over already. But your mood, mm -hmm. you you surrounded by all those cups. It's so nice. Well, the outcome for the end of summer for Scorpio, how this situation will develop. What? Ah, oh, wow, wow, wow! Luck, luck, abundance, um, support, uh, getting something big getting something good, feeling safe, feeling comfortable, getting a lot of money probably. So I don't know what's going on Scorpio, but it's a wonderful reading. It's really, really good reading. Uh, Ten, of, uh, Ten of Pentacles. It's card of abundance. Obviously, it's a rich woman. This girls, uh, it's like, I, I think it's slaves in a ancient Egypt. <laughs> they dressing her, they taking care of her. She has everything. She is young, pretty, beautiful, rich, healthy. What else she can dream of? So, and it's also card of family, card of luck, of course, card of comfort and security. So whatever is happening, you have to watch your condition, I mean your mood. You might be a little bit unstable. I don't see anything around you 
that is okay this woman maybe she's spoiling you some of you Scorpio this woman maybe she's spoiling you a little bit and always trying to give you this that please what do you think do you like it all right I'll cook something else uh, for me it feels like this for some Scorpio this woman spoiling you maybe it's a mother maybe it's someone who loves you so much and want to do everything for you and ready to do everything for you if you have been waiting uh, for a child for grandchild especially for some of you I think it will be you will be so happy you will feel yourself a rich person not rich in money but happy and rich like we have such a wonderful family we have continuation of our um, how you call it I don't know the word but you understand when we have this family roots we have our grandmother grandfather then we have our parents and we have us we have our children grandchildren and so on so this like big and uh, happy rich line of your family a wonderful reading Scorpio wonderful ah can you imagine on the bottom of the deck you've got the king of chalices so I don't know so many so much happiness so much so many emotions so much love in your reading uh, so it's a happy reading Scorpio it's really a happy reading another man here is a queen of chalices here is a king of chalices probably it's a couple and you see the deck was upright and reversed you've got only one reversal for your own condition for your own way of action for your mood probably and how you see things and keep in mind with the wheel uh, being reversed maybe some happy things you don't see them or I, I, I will not say you not appreciate them but maybe at this moment at this particular moment you concentrating on something else and all this abundance and happiness that you have in your life you like not noticing it you're not seeing it as as a happiness but it is happiness whatever it will be so Scorpio I don't have anything else to say because it's a really a happy reading I know you can't see everything but I wanted to show you magician as well how people doing it in a clever way I'll try it as well so you can see all cards it was nine of chalices in the middle mm -hmm. ah, I can do it only like this and it's also the lamp is <laughs> there disturbing the picture so Scorpio I'm wishing you luck great summer be in the good mood see for things see things for what they are keep yourself calm if you're nervous for some reason if you're worrying for some reason and you have reliable people around you who really care about you who loves you who ready to give you almost everything what they have keep it in mind please wishing you luck and great summer bye bye